Oh, we got a nice rainy day. We're at the Wagner Nursery here. Just to give you kind of an idea of the size of uh, Wagner Nursery where we're taking care of the water. and uh, It's a pretty good sized complex. They, uh, uh, I think he was saying it was, uh, they ship out about uh, 35 million plants um, just, you know, each month. So they've got a lot of process of uh, water and things that's going on. It's raining, so I'm going to have to let you go. Thank you. And, uh, and the watering that we do, straight watering, some of the fertilizing water comes out of the treated tank up there with the acid. Some of it comes right out of the ecosystem. But all the water comes through the ecosystem anyway, either way. It all comes through that first before it goes into the treatment system or goes out to the fertilizer. And I think that's what's... Now your acid it. treatment system, are you treating the lower or the raise? We're trying to lower. It's that high. Yeah, you're on the alcohol. Yeah, we're too high in pH. Yeah. And it did help after we put the filtration system. doesn't do anything to the pH, but it seems to level out the well water. I don't know why, but it seems to level the well water out, so we're getting a more of an even flow because we were, I was going up and down all yeah. over the board. And now it's coming more even through. The well water isn't, if it wasn't high price, we put city water in and we wouldn't have to really even treat yeah. that part. But we don't have city water. It's out here, but not for what it costs, we're not going to put it in. Because they charge us sewer fee according to what we use for water, and we use a lot of water. Oh. <laughs> we can no. treat it. That's yeah. well, like the ecosystem doesn't yeah. cost us anything, really, yeah. once it's in. Yep. You know, now, how's the system doing as far as iron removal and manganese? I don't even check it, but I guess what, what we tried at the first when we put it in, it, uh, it dropped it down. And like I said, the main checking I can tell is on the drinking water. When you can tell a difference there, you know it's doing the same thing the rest of the way because yeah. our drinking water was not. You make good. coffee and you got iron. Now we can make coffee. coffee <laughs> that drink that, that's what goes through the system and everything. Mm -hmm. and, and I guess I've always kind of judged it by that. If it's good drinking water, you got pretty good water. Mm -hmm. and, and it did cut down on the algae problem as far as on the filters out here and stuff, we were getting, with citric acid, we were getting kind of slime, and that took care of part of that. And nothing's going to take care of everything entirely, but it's going to help. <coughs> well, because we, we're counteracting, like I told you earlier, we're counteracting ourselves. We're, we're taking <coughs> out, and then we're putting in fertilizer, and we're working against ourselves, same as far as algae and everything else, and we're adding fertilizer, and you've got, you've got uh, compost-type soil that we're you're going to get uh -huh. some of that anyhow, no matter what kind of water you put. But you got to kind of come back. <coughs> you can, anyhow. Right. But as far as the operation of the system, your your sprinkler heads, your lines, and all that are staying clear and free oh, yeah. for yeah. iron. Yeah. You're not we getting didn't. calcium buildup and yeah. so forth. We'll we'll get once in a while. We got to clean injectors, kind of, or the uh, nozzles once in a while, all the time. But you still get some sediment and stuff from. Uh, just from the system as far as that goes. <coughs> but as far as any buildup in there, you're not getting any uh, big rust buildup or anything like that. Calcium in deposits and stuff. Yeah. 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 Well, it's taken care of that pretty much. And like, and we're so we're keeping things pretty well in solution as far as going through the lines and not turning into particles. Grab the particles upstairs in the filters and then everything yeah, else stays because, in solution uh, pretty well. And you can see like, <coughs> last time you cleaned them, they needed cleaning again. Yep. And I mean, yeah. so you, you know you're doing something when you're taking something out. Yeah. You know, part of that quote. That was your copper thing you were cleaning. Yeah. Titanium, 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 titanium. This is a, uh, a just kind of a shot of what their uh, main area nursery looks like. And um, they have uh, uh, watering stations here that are overhead and you can see the the pipes and things like the hoses and things like that down at the end of this. Um, the sta this watering station itself just uh, automatically comes over the top of the rails and you know that's the part that they need to be able to keep clean in. There's a, it's a pretty good sized nursery you know we've got two sides of it here then. Um, it's kind of interesting to see how that works but 
main part of that is the descaling and, and again making water wetter so that it goes into the soil and and uh, has better penetration uh, with the plant itself. Well, we're going to wrap this up. This is uh, Wagner Nursery in in Hugo, Minnesota.